That's a good boy. So he's got water. Yeah. He's pretty hydrated now. He's been doing good. We're deep in Utah land, man. Gas is getting cheaper. The rocks are getting redder. Now he's still drinking. He said he liked water, so he's a good boy. He did his stuff earlier, so he's a happy boy. We're gonna let him try again if he wants to. He found him a chicken bone earlier and he he apparently knew he wasn't supposed to have it because uh it's it just like that stuff. Uh-uh. No, no boo-boo, come on. Yeah, he he came across a chicken bone all of a sudden. That chicken bone was gone. What is that? Leave that stuff alone. You like that you don't care about dogs, but boy, you'll find some food or something, won't you? So that's what I have to be careful with with this guy. But he's a sweetheart. We're finally out of the freaking heat. My God, it was between, it bounced between 112 and 116 for about four to five hours. And it was above 106 to 108 for even longer than that. It was in freaking sane. Then the rains came. We got a little up into Utah and we started getting some relief. And it's actually 82 degrees now. Look at the striping on the rocks. It's fascinating to me. That's got to be some kind of sedimentary kind of thing going on there. And then the volcanic upheaval. All right, let's, let's eat a bush. Okay, anyway, your baby's good. It's not hot anymore. All is good. All is well. My favorite three words to tell my clients, all is well.